some of the ingredients that you're going to need first i diced up some um red yellow and orange peppers and then i cut up some um turkey kielbasa sausage coxa sausage just how you pronounce it um deveined and clean my shrimp um y'all know if y'all watch my recipes how i clean my meat comment it down below um and i cut up some chicken breast and also you're going to need heavy whipping cream um, some penne noodles and diced tomatoes. Now, I when I made this the first time, guys, I used one of these and another one of the other one. I'll link the actual um, recipe down below because I didn't use um, both of the same kinds of diced tomatoes, but it'll have to do this time, you know. This is the seasoning that we're going to be using this time. First, I used Tony Saturay, but this time I'm going to use Slap Yo Mama. And, um, yeah, I'm going to see how this is. I'm not sure if it's super spicy, but the Tony Saturay wasn't, but it got some really good se um, flavor seasons and stuff in there. So, yeah, we're going to try this one out. So, right here, guys, we're pretty much cooking the peppers down so they can be a little bit softer. You don't want them, like, super, super soft, but you want them, like, you know, this might not be the right thing. Don't use this, yo. Use something proper. So now, at this part, you should be focusing on adding your sausage. Add the sausage. And cook that down. The sausage takes a little bit longer than uh, the chicken, and especially the shrimp. Y'all going to see what I do with the shrimp. That's going to be the last meat that we add. So we just want to make sure we get some salt on this sausage, let like that cook down with the peppers. Now we're going to add the chicken breast. All you need is one chicken breast, guys. Just one. Chicken breast takes about five minutes to cook, y'all. Just about five. Just make sure y'all separate. Well, you know, y'all turn that fire down. You see how it's already getting that cooked whiteness to it, y'all? It don't take long. sticks of butter, minced garlic, and some Parmesan cheese. This is the Parmesan cheese. Um, just mix it up. You see all that cheese stuck to my waist? That's how your sauce should look when it's done, y'all. Nice and creamy and cheesy and all bubbles. So once it's done, you just turn the fire down. Like this, yummy, good, 
saucy. Yes. Thank you for tuning into my vlog. If you like this video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next one. Thank you. Bye bye. <laughs>